hello from Disney's Animal Kingdom. We are, and by we I mean Corey and I, are gonna be eating at Harambe Market. So um, this is one of the quick services, all outdoor in the little Africa area of the park. So this is going to be the Impossible Kafta. Um, it has Impossible Kafta on it, um, a plant-based aioli, the tremola, which is basically like a kind of like a African pico de gallo, if you will. And then it's on this pita, and then it comes with house-made chips. Um, Corey's already munched on a few, and he's trying to figure out the seasoning. So maybe when he takes a bite of it, we'll get a proper uh, idea of what the seasoning is. Um, the pita seems pretty solid to hold in terms of the food that is with it. Um, but I, it also looks like it's going to be dry, so... It looks very dry. It looks really dry. You can't really like fold it without smushing it all, so we'll see. As long as it doesn't rip. Um, it is dry. The kefta or kofta or whatever isn't warm. I don't know if it should be warm or not. Um, get rid of this tomato, this is the top of the tomato. But you can see there's a bunch of seasonings in it. So that's nice, I guess. Um, compared to what they've had in the past at this location, namely the vegetable curry they used to have, this doesn't really do it for me. It's kind of the same quality as um, what I got over at Kusafiri that I did not love. It's like the same thing in a different font is <laughs> basically how it feels so we'll see how Corey feels about it so these chips have some of them have like a bunch of seasoning on them some don't um so i'll try they're well seasoned at least this one is i wonder if it's like a curry because the ones i think over at kusafiri had a curry seasoning on the as well, if not at least like turmeric. Um, that, that means like paprika. Uh-huh. And like obviously salt, but those are good. So there's that. Now I'm gonna try this. Like with three little burger patties. I actually like this. I, my bite wasn't that dry. Pita. The remind me of um, pollution garden spread kind of. Um, like the meatballs, like flavor wise. They only I'm not sure what because they they say it's plant based. I don't think they can say what it's supposed to be. So I'm, I wonder what. You have no idea what they're going for. It's yellow mayo. Yeah, okay. yeah and then it's pretty much like a plain pico on it if you eat by itself, but I actually like this together. Maybe my bite was dry because I had like the end of the mm -hmm. Try another bite this time. The soup bite I had. I wouldn't consider it dry. I actually like it. Um, I would expect it to be warm. When I got it, obviously I knew because Melissa ate it first. Um, but it doesn't take away from anything. I actually liked it a lot. I would come back with it back then. And then, yeah, the chips. It's almost like, like Melissa had turmeric, which I don't know if I can't pick it up, but it's kind of yellowy. But like salt and turmeric and almost like Maybe paprika on it. That was a super curry bite, so I think it's some kind of curry on it. These are actually really good. Um, a lot of times, the chips that they make here are almost like burnt. 
and or not seasoned. Um, usually they have like a bird taste. Um, these are actually cooked really good. They're really crispy. The curry's really good on too, but no burn taste like usual. So I actually like this meal a lot. Round two. All right. We'll see. I still just think the pita is really dry. I think I just don't like these types of pitas. I think that's what it is. Because it's just, I need it. Maybe the pita needs to be warmed or something. Like there's just something about it to me that's just like, it ain't it for me. Um, also, we did, didn't know, but we did get a drink. I don't remember what it's called. Something flamingo. It's like a non-alcoholic thing and it was um, strawberry. strawberry and passion fruit. Corey says it's yummy, I haven't tried it yet. It's, it's a slushy. Sweet, like refreshing drink. I mean, actually, it's like tastes like fresh strawberries too. Um, that's yeah, good. It's not overly sweet, which I like. I like that. Super strawberry tasting. <laughs> um, I wonder if warm warm the pita would help, or use like a naan, which I know it's hard to find. Yeah, I just this is like the bread. same type of pita they had like Kusafiri. It's like I, I mean, you can see it just like all the flour, yeah. which I mean, they're not making these. But, um, I mean, you see it and you can tell it's dry. But I think for my bites with the sauce coming on it, mine wasn't overly dry. Um, it could be a little better, but I liked it. it good, quick little light, lighter uh, lunch, little meal. What did you say when we got it? So that's supposed to be a meal? Yeah. Size. <laughs> but, I mean, there's a lot of chips, but I mean, it's pretty filling. But when you first see it, you're like, that's what I said, it's a light lunch, light meal. <laughs> That's good though, I like it. Do you like that more than I did? I did. Uh, good. I ended up looking but. at the picture from when I had it at Kusafiri and it's literally the exact same thing. Um, the only difference is it doesn't have potato sticks and it was put in the pita pocket. It's a different presentation. Same food, different font. But you liked it, so. Yeah, it was good. Don't take my word on it, you liked it. So. Um, the aioli didn't really, add, I don't know what the flavor is supposed to be. It tastes so like, no. like anything no. um the actual like meat um was good remind me of pollution garden spread mm -hmm. when i ate it on its own it did yeah not exactly the same but it was good mm -hmm. um and then the whatever the salsa stuff's called Afri Trimala. african Trimala. Yeah, that that was fine good um if you do think it's dry had a bot you could make it into nachos so just yep. dump out the stuff in the pita, put on the chips. It'd be delicious nachos. Those chips are awesome. Which is what I did at Kusafiri because it all fell out. <laughs> <laughs> so again, same food, two different yeah. locations that you can get it, just different pita style, basically. Only on the they, the yeah. meats cut up differently. Like these were patties, whereas at Kusafiri it's like ground beef. But yeah. anyway, thank you for following along. Later.